we don't sleep a lot with our careers, right? True. So every once in a while, maybe you can get a nap in, in the middle of the day. But yesterday, my wife's out of town. She's with my son, Kemp, you know, who, who plays basketball in Hawaii. And they're like going up and down the coast of California playing. And um, it's just me and Dutch. My son, Jake, is at school at the University of Arizona. So it's just Dutch and me. So we decided to go. I decided to go with him to his afternoon training. And then we were going to grab a bite to eat for dinner. And um, I'm also looking for a, a, a new backpack. I can't. My backpack's broke, right? So I was looking for a new backpack. It's just kind of looking around. And I saw this guy the other day, and he had a really cool backpack. I said, how do you like that backpack? He goes, I love it. Goes, Where'd you get it? And he got it at the Yeti store, right? Yeti. You ever heard of a Yeti? Yeah. Yeah, right? So I'm like, <laughs> okay, where's the Yeti store? Turns out the Yeti store took over the old Nike store at Scottsdale Quarter, oh. right? So my plan is Dutch and I, we're going to go work out. I'm going to watch him work out, and then I'm going to go to the Yeti store, and then I'm going to get a bite to eat with him. So I'm driving this Ford Bronco Raptor from Pat Hickey at Peoria Ford, driving it around. It's a great car. A little too much for me. It's like, uh, I'm not, it, it's just manly. You know what I mean? Like, I'm, I don't need that. But I'm driving it around. I park at the, at the gym. And at this gym, there's lots of pro football players that go there when the season's off. There's a lot of pro athletes there, a lot of soccer players. A lot of, I mean, there's, if, if you know sports, you'll recognize these people. I don't really. I know I recognize Odell Beckham every once in a while, and um, that's about it. I don't re- recognize other ones. So NFL Films was there, and they're filming uh, a bunch of stuff for the Combine. And they're film. They're they're, about, they're getting the camera set up, and you know how Grant sometimes gets the lights up, and, the, yeah. and then the big white screen to reflect. And they got a chair, and they they have a stand in. And I'm like, so who's this for? And they said, oh, it's for uh, this guy in the combine. Uh, and I go, so he's in college. He's not even like in in the in the NFL. They go, no, he's he's going to be. I go, how do you know he's going to be? If he's in the combine. Oh, he's going to go top five. His name is like called. Tua, Tua from uh, UCLA. He's going to be whatever. He's like a big deal. I'm like, oh, that's cool. So Dutch is working out. I got nothing to do. I'm wiped out. I'm tired. And there's a massage room that I usually slide into to take a nap. I walk in there. People are getting massages. <laughs> Oops. So I'm like, oh, yeah. Okay, so in the lobby, there's two huge couches and a couple of chairs. And there's nobody there. So I'm like, I'm just going to lay down on this couch and close my eyes for a second. Just to, I only need five minutes. Close my eyes. There's nobody there. And I don't know how much time goes by, but I start snoring and I wake myself up from snoring. So I'm like, <sighs> like oh that's God. one of those deals, right? Because <laughs> I don't have my CPAP machine. And I wake up and sitting in a chair as close as you are, Kyle, is the world's largest man. And he's got huge Crocs on and he's in shorts. He's covered in tattoos and he's just leaning over and he's looking at me. And I wake up and I'm so, and I look at him and I go, oh God, sorry, I must have fallen asleep. And he's like... You're good, man. You're good. <laughs> and just staring at me. Oh, it was so... Hi. I think it was that guy. Oh, really? Waiting, waiting for them to set up the camera. Yeah, because the lady... I go, oh, she goes, I go, is he here yet? She goes, oh, you'll know when he's here. He's huge. I'm like, oh, okay. So anyway, Dutch is done working out. I'm driving this Bronco to Scottsdale Quarter. And we go into the parking structure, right? So it's a, it's a big parking lot. And I'm zigzagging in between. And Dutch says, I bet you it's really hard to park this thing. You know, and I'm dad to a 17 year old so i'm like uh it's all about the skills of the driver son and there's one space up there right and i pull into the space i go you gotta know what you're doing you gotta know how to do it and i park right we get out of the car the car starts rolling backwards oh, <laughs> like, no. i forgot to put it in in park or something oh, no. i don't know and he's like dad the car's moving oh and my god it's full how do you stop this a bronco is, literally i finished my sentence about how you got to be a, a skilled driver <laughs> and there's nobody more skilled than your dad oh, the car my gosh. I, I jump in and i throw it in park and it goes like this and then i i didn't even turn it off I was like, what the? So then I get out, we're walking out, and he goes, look at how you park. And I'm parked just like diagonal in the space. I'm like, it'll be fine. So then I go to this Yeti place, right? That's my backpack. My let Yeti backpack. See, let cool. me see. I'm a backpack it's fan. Nice and it's just a backpack. Black and plain and yeah, it's pretty simple. The, the way they sold it on to me, the guy goes, look at this. You zip it from the side, and you can put a thermos in there. I'm like, great. When are you ever going to use a thermos? Exactly. (laughs) (laughs) John Jay walks in with this thermos full of soup every day. (laughs) 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 